All right, back today on the C5 Corvette. Today we're going to attempt to change out the OEM, probably original to the car, halogen headlight bulbs. Right now they're really dim at light, of course, and you can't really see them that well, so I picked up a set of LED bulbs from Vet Lights from their 4th of July sale. So we're gonna get those swapped in here and I'm gonna to try to document the process the best that I can. What we do here is there's going to be Phillips head screws for the headlight bezel. There's gonna be one here, and then there's also gonna be two on this side, one here and then one back there as well. So we're gonna get this unscrewed and pull off the bezel. All right, so we got those three screws out. I'm gonna to try to do this with one hand, but there's a clip up here on top. And that seat just comes right down here and then you pull out the plastic bezel right here. It's gonna be a little difficult to see here on the camera. But if I try to get my phone back in here, go in my wide view, you could see some of the wires back over here. That's where each of your bulbs are gonna be. So the inner bulb on the driver's side is going to be your high beam, and then the outer bulb is gonna be your low beam. It's just simply twisting it out and pulling out each of the bulbs, and then we're gonna to try to put the new ones back in from vet lights. Try not to touch the actual glass of them themselves. They're good spares just in case you need them. Um, just put them in a safe spot or discard them as per your local regulations. So we're gonna get the LEDs installed down on the driver's side. All right, we have the LED high beam and low beam lights installed on the driver's side here. Quick little comparison. You could definitely tell that the white is more light. We'll pan over here to the passenger side where it's definitely a yellow tint halogen, the old school style of bulbs from the GM early 90s. Uh, through the 2000s. What a difference there. I mean, it's still light out where I am. It's probably about uh, four o'clock in the afternoon here, but even then, so you could definitely tell the difference here. Uh, again, what we did here for the driver's side is we removed the plastic bezel, the three screws on the driver's side and passenger side here for this specific light. Same as it goes on the passenger side there. Once you remove the plastic bezel for the light, you simply locate the two bulbs on the back of the housing here. You can see where the bulbs are. Remove the old bulbs, slide in the new bulbs. The low beam light definitely screwed in a little bit easier for me than the high beam light, but that also might be user error. But so far, I'm really happy. We're gonna to go to the other side here. Uh, if you have any questions for me, please drop them in the comments section below, but definitely recommend these bulbs. Again, these LEDs are from Vet Lights. Also a popular upgrade is the Night Drive TV low rise headlights. I highly recommend those as well. I had them on my old C5, um, but just wanted to try these out on here. So happy lighting.